this tech tip, we're going to introduce a few ways that you can model faster by using some great functionality within the Dimension Modify box. Now if you wanted to define a dimension, nearly all SOLIDWORKS users are going to go and just key in the specific value, like 135 or 80. But that might not be the most efficient way to find a dimension that works for you and your design intent. Now some users will use these arrow keys here to dynamically increase or decrease the value. But very few know that you can use your middle mouse wheel to change the value. Right now, all I'm doing is scrolling my middle mouse wheel to either increase or decrease the value. So let's try that again here with this dimension. Again, all I'm doing is rolling my middle mouse wheel forwards to increase it and backwards to decrease it. But how about this? Let's use this great tool known as the thumb wheel, which is found right below the dimension value. The thumb wheel allows me to control the dimension size dynamically here from within the modify box. Simply click and hold on the thumb wheel and then move your mouse to the right or to the left to increase or decrease it. Now as I change this value here, you can see how this feature allows me to dynamically play with the dimensions while the sketches are automatically updating in real time. Now when I roll my middle mouse wheel, you can see that it's changing in one degree increments. But you can change this on the fly by pressing either the control or alt keys to speed it up or slow it down by a factor of 10. As I press the control key and roll my middle mouse wheel, it'll change it at 10 degree increments. And when I press and hold the alt key and roll my middle mouse wheel, it'll change it at a tenth of a degree increment. Now if you wanted to change the default values for this tool, you simply go to your system options and under spin box increments, you can key in the value that you want to use.